Hello everyone. Let's provide the solution to this. 4 to the power of x equals 24. We cannot solve this problem without including or um, taking the log of both sides, right? So we're going to have log 4 to the power of x equals log 24. Now I'm going to show all the steps that you can find in this, right? Now, according to the power law of log, these can go behind so that we have x log 4 equal to log 24, right? Okay, so from here now we can divide both sides by the by log 4. This is because we are looking for the value of x. So we divide this by log 4 as well. And our x is going to be log 24 over log 4. This is because this and this can cancel. But now, we can still reduce this to a lower term without using calculator. Because from here, we're going to have x to be equal to log 24 here is 4 times 6, right? So this will now be over log 4. Do not make any mistake by cancelling what you have here. This is because if you have log a, B, it is equal to log A plus log B, right? So that means I'm going to split what I have there so that X will be equal to log 4 plus log 6. And this is all over log 4. And then what does this mean? This means that X is equal to log 4 over log 4 plus log 6 over log 4 because from here if you find the LCM it will still give you back what we have over there now this will go there and we are going to have x to be equal to 1 plus log 6 over log 4 but we're not stopping here because we can still simplify what we have here, right? So to simplify this, we're going to have x to be equal to 1 plus log, log, um, log 6 is 2 times 3, right? Okay, all over log 4 on its own. Okay, let's have log 4 first. So that's from here x will now be equal to 1 plus log 2 plus log 3. All of this is over log 4, just like we did before. To continue, x will be equal to 1 plus log 2 over log 4 plus log 3 over log 4 okay so this is what we have and um, from here we can still simplify what we have here right we can simplify this let's continue so that x will be equal to 1 plus we have log 2 all over log 2 to the power of 2 remember um, 2 to the power of 2 will give us 4, right? Plus, here we'll have the same log 3 over log 4. Let's continue. Okay, so x is equal to 1. Now, this power here can go behind, so I'll have log 2 first over 2 log 2. 
then we have plus log 3 over log 4. To continue with this, our x will be equal to 1 plus, remember we have 1 here, we have 2 here, and 1 is up. So this is 1 over 2 into log 2 over log 2. Then plus log 3 over log 4. This is what we have. And now this can go with this. We have 1. 1 times 1 over 2 is still 1 over 2. So x is equal to 1 plus 1 over 2 plus log 3 over log 4. Now let's add this together x will be equal to 1 plus 1 over 2. This will give us some um, 3 over 2 plus log 3 over log 4. Okay. By the way, some persons will be asking how did we get 3 over 2 as 1 plus 1 over 2. Now let me do that here. 1 plus 1 over 2. This is over 1 as well, right? So to find the LCM, you're going to have 2. Then 2 divided by 1 is 2 times 2 times 1. We have 2. Plus 2 divided by 2 is 1 times 1. We have 1. So we have 3 over 2 if you put this together, right? Now back to what we have here. We're going to have, if you have log A over log A, b since they are having the same base it is the same thing as log a to the base of b okay so this is called change of base so we're going to do the same thing to this so that our x will be equal to 3 over 2 plus in place of this now we're going to write log 3 to the base of 4 right so this becomes the, the value of x that we are looking for. And by the way, you can press your calculator to get the value of this. You press log 3 to base 4, and it gives you this. Or, oh, by the way, I think this is where you stop. You can equally get this in decimal. And then you add up to get what you're looking for. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you.